terms of um, work, video stuff, something kind of happened recently in uh, my personal life that I'll talk about eventually, but uh, it's it's just not, not the time to talk about it. But um, yes, I'm going to stop recording actually. So I do want to talk about QSMP stuff because I promised I would. Um, I don't, it's, I, I haven't thought about what I wanted to say in terms of, um, just like, my plan, you know? But, I think, overall, I, after like, okay, so, 2023 was, uh, a year where I experimented with um, streaming more, I did, uh, QSMP is like the only thing that I've done like it, and it was really fun, really exciting, I got to delve into this whole new, like, world and community, made so many friends, um, but the, and it's not, I think it got very overwhelming for me in the, ter in the fact of just, it got very, overpowering in my mind just like just participating in it I'll be honest it's because I think it's a really fun concept it's got like there's constantly stuff going on there's constant story everything's everyone's got like their own lore and plot and it feels like every single day there's something new happening and that's really fun for the audience and as a creator but at the same time, it started kind of being too much for me in the fact that QSMP is like a full-time job and I just don't have time to have another full-time job. And I just, I don't know. It started getting to me in the way where content has never gotten to me before. Sorry. <laughs> um, but... And when I say that, I don't mean like anything happened. Like not, no, like it. None of this is on QSMP's fault. This is on on Quackity's fault. I'm just not really built for the environment and community that QSMP puts me in. It's very overwhelming. It's very every everything is exciting and entertaining. And I was it was kind of like changing the way I thought about content in the way of like I just have to be a part of everything I need to be constantly looking on Twitter and seeing what people say and making people exciting and everything has to get keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger and it was really just starting to eat away at my just like everything <laughs> um in terms of like work balance personal life balance just like mental health it's just really really overwhelming to be in and I decided, you know, a couple months ago, I was like, oh, okay, this, I'm at, I, I reached a point where I decided I just wanted to feel a little normal again. Um, so I took a break, uh, tried to kind of like rebuild everything again, just not focus on it. Uh, it was partially the reason why I deleted Twitter because it was every like moment of the day if i wasn't streaming i would be like checking twitter and seeing what people are saying and it was, i just don't like living that life i i don't i've never been the type of content creator to be wanting to be like that and i it was kind of turning me into a person that i just didn't want to be it wasn't like a bad person uh but it was a version of myself that i decided that i didn't want to fuel you know and it's again nothing qsmp didn't do anything to me it's a very exciting project and it's it's hard to step away from it because it feels it's so innovative it's so exciting it's so cool and i'm so lucky to have been invited and i'm so grateful for the opportunity to even be a part of it but unfortunately i just i just don't think it's it's for me in terms of it's, it's just like too much and um so yeah i i decided i wanted to like taking the break i was like maybe if i can like get my shit together kind of figure out like a healthy way to 
deal with everything and, and balance everything, maybe it would be uh, something that I could come back to eventually. But after like taking the couple months off, I more and more was just deciding that it would be better to just not come back to it. Unfortunately, I and I feel bad. I know a lot of you met me through QSMP and I'm very grateful. Um, I do want to stream still. It'll be not very often because I, I really only want to stream to record videos. Um, so if that for just say it's okay if you only wanted to watch me for for Minecraft. It's really okay. And if you decide that I'm not for you in terms of outside of Minecraft streams, then thank you for uh, paying attention to me for a little bit. It was nice to to have your viewership, and this is our this is the end of the road for us in our content um, relationship, I suppose. <laughs> but yeah, it's, I don't really, I don't know. I don't know what else to say about it, honestly. It's like, I'm, I'm so grateful for Quackity. He's doing incredible stuff. It's so cool. It was some, you could say it was too cool. <laughs> and it was, it was destroying me. I've got, I've mentioned it before. I've just got really addictive personality and it was, it, I was just a little too addicted to the, all this, um, just the environment that was um, in it. Not saying, again, not saying it's bad. I'm just saying that's just, I don't think I'm the right fit for it. Um, in terms of like story and like my character and stuff, I did mention to the mods um, and the admins that I'm gonna be taking a really long break. Um, I asked them to, I honestly asked them to just kill her. <laughs> I asked them to kill Jaden, and then if she came back, maybe she could, like, come back as, I don't know, something. But, um, we can just say that, for for lore's sake, we can just say, until unless the admins or, like, the story writers decide something else, um, she's just, she blew up. <laughs> we can say she... She was on the island, she knew the, the bombs were coming, and she just didn't want to go back. <laughs> we can just say that. <laughs> um, she's- I've always- I mean, nothing in store was ever gonna be good for her. <laughs> I, I like tragic characters, and I love torturing them, so nothing good was ever gonna happen to Jaden. Because I like being evil like that, but I think that's- a fitting message, or a fitting story, she just blew up. <laughs> Unless, you know, the admins, it's, the character is always in the hands of the admins. So if they want to change things, like they did say that maybe they'll tell some story through lore overall in the server. So if they ever want to do that, that's just, whatever the admins want, totally can and totally fine with me. But until further notice, <laughs> we can just assume that she's dead. <laughs> Which I think is, it's probably a, a good little symbolism <laughs> overall. But yeah, I'm sorry it took so long for me to say something. Um, I just haven't streamed, didn't want to say it, like, didn't want to like post a, a weird um, document online. <laughs> it's not really that serious. But, yeah, <laughs> thank you for everyone uh, uh, for joining me on my little Minecraft uh, journey. It's unfortunately m met its end, but I, I appreciate all the, all the opportunities and the, the people I've met through it. But yeah, I think that's, I think, I'm pretty sure that's the majority of what I wanted to say on that. Um... Yeah, I'm just moving on, and I would appreciate if, if if anyone is sticking around, would like to move on with me. I don't really want to look back at QSMP for the rest of my streaming career, so I not. It's not that I don't want to talk about it. I just don't want it to follow me around for forever, you know. So yeah, that's that's my stance on it. 
that's things are good. I'm doing good. I'm doing much. I'm doing the best I've been in a while. I think 2023 was good, but it was also very overwhelming and very much a lot for me. So yes, I, I appreciate your viewership. I appreciate your attention. I appreciate all the nice things you guys say about me. The this community has been the most vocal in in support I've ever had, and I do appreciate it. But this is this is goodbye. This is changing changing lanes. Um, I'm going to be a much more <laughs> variety streamer, like I like I always wanted to be. Um, from now on, it'll probably be streams will majority be for recordings and yeah that's the plan that's what i want to do but thank you very much um thank you for coming to my my welcome back stream it's not a welcome back stream it's just a stream because i need to record <laughs> but thank you for staying with me um and i'll see you around if all my up i'm still deleted and off of twitter so um if you want any oopsie what the heck what happened to my eyes whoa Whoa! There we go. If you want to keep up with me, I will only be posting on Instagram stories. That's like the only place I want to post. I'm pretty much done with Twitter. Uh, I'll go on there to like see fan art and stuff because I like putting it at the end of my videos and I want to keep up with it. Um, but yeah, just follow my Instagram if you... I, I really also don't post much there either. I really just disappear off the internet until I return for a little bit and then I leave. But that's that's why that's all I wanted to say. Thank you so much. I'll see you sometime. I think Jacob and I are gonna maybe stream. It takes two this week. Maybe on Wednesday, I think it is. Wednesday or Thursday. But we'll see. Again, some something happened in our life that is making things a little difficult. Things are okay, don't worry. We're safe. But 